Mm, the chorizo and egg is fire. Mm, but our is not bad either. Mm. You want to switch? Uh-huh. Yo, Carlos, what are you doing here? What a call the neighborhood. Thought I'd surprise your son with some street tacos. Well, I hope you brought enough tacos for everybody. I did, actually. Oh, you got us one one tacos? <laughs> he did get us one one tacos. Hey, <laughs> you, sir, are a golden god. You want one, Owen? Oh, oh, no, no, I can't have any tacos. I have a wedding to go to. Which reminds me, there is a cake tasting tomorrow at the house. Is that, um... Really necessary? I mean, we're just gonna go with the traditional white from the same panaderia that did both of my sister's quinceañeras. Yeah. Yeah, no, I wanna throw another candidate into the mix. Another candidate? Yeah. I mean, look, I, I have a place on Alvarado Street that is gluten-free, sugar-free, and dairy-free. Sounds flavor-free. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you can laugh all you want, but you'd be shocked what you can do with monk fruit and teff these days. I'm sorry, did you say teff or teft? You know, I've seen it a thousand times. The party's going great, and then they bring out the cake. And everybody dives in, and they get that high fructose corn syrup and then sugar crash, mm. and everybody starts heading for the exits. Mm. And the whole joy is just sucked out of the wedding. Imagine that. Mm. All right, so promise me you'll just give it a chance. Tomorrow, 3 o'clock. Yes, sir. Just mm. when I thought he couldn't get any more Dadzilla, he puts monk's fruit on our wedding cake. I believe it's just monk fruit. No possessive. What?